Senior Pastor of the Living Faith Church, Goshen, Bishop David Abioye has attributed poor leadership as reasons for economic woes and state of underdevelopment in Nigeria and other African countries. Bishop Abioye gave the indication at a lecture to mark his 60th birthday in Abuja. He said leadership is about harnessing human resources which the continent boasts of, but regrets the inability of those in authority to do the needful. Most nations in the West don't have mineral resources as we do, but they are less human resources. But uh, a, a leader that does not have a head cannot take the lead. You know, uh, like I say that, you see, if you don't have a head, you cannot go ahead. It takes the head to go ahead. So the nation will go ahead if the head or the heads um, as a group are functional. Speaking at a lecture which attracted dignitaries from far and near, the guest lecturer, Pastor David Ibiomi of the Salvation Ministry, who spoke on the topic, Building Leadership That Last, But a Call to Serve. He further highlighted attributes of servant leadership. Nigeria talks about the election. Statesmen talk about the next generation. Politicians talk about the next election. What Nigeria needs now is not politicians, we need a statesman. We'll think of the next generation, not just next election. As expected, speaker after speaker poor accolades of Bishop Abioye exemplary leadership. A good leader is patient. And I've seen that with our celebrant and our father. He is patient with us. Bishop is so patient with us. He tolerates us. It's like God in your lifetime wants you to save something phenomenal in our lifetime. Not just from within the living faith, but in our nation. There is something you are yet to enter into its fullness. Maybe the starting point will be this leadership thing. Our hands must be on deck. It is not only the politicians, it's not only the leaders, the governments are also. We must work towards understanding ourselves. The leaders will understand their limits and their boundary. The also the rule, we also know what to expect from the leaders. Gospel musician popularly known as Choma Jesus was on ground to spice up the celebration. 